What's going on YouTube? Trying some sourcing again. This is uh, experiment number like three or four over at the Goodwill outlet. It's super close down by my house so uh, it's really convenient. I can just hop over there. I only went over there for maybe an hour and a half or something. And uh, I mean, you just kind of pick through giant barrels, bins of stuff. And uh, today I spent $30, all right? And my intent is to sell 90% of this stuff and uh, maybe keep a thing or two and make, hopefully, you know, triple my money. Uh, so I'm gonna go through real quick what I got here. Like I said, I, I spent about $31, all right? Um, first of all, gonna go to the boogie boards all right I got two boogie boards today um, you know maybe they're, they're slightly used or something but uh, there's not a whole lot of boogie boarding in this area so I don't think they're used too hard so uh, hopefully I just get to keep those and hopefully I'll get to use them soon <laughs> uh, moving on I got today was the first time I ever tried clothes right going over to the clothes bin and thinking in my head could I sell any of this because you pretty much just buy these clothes by the weight and of course I get like you know a small pile of things for myself here um, some Iowa um, pants and this big old fleece that is super thick and I'm just gonna use that for like snowboarding or something got an avalanche sweater I haven't made up my mind if I want to try to sell that or keep that um, I also got just a regular shirt. I don't know what the brand is. American Rag. I haven't really heard of that. Also got this Nike shirt. Endless Victory. I like that. That cost me, I don't probably hardly anything. But uh, anyway, so I might keep those things. Uh, moving on to some more stuff I'm probably going to sell. Got a grumpy um, beanie. Looks like it was in super good condition. Hopefully I can sell that for a few bucks. Harley Davidson uh, cap with the leather in the front here. Um, hopefully that will go for a few bucks online. Remember I spent 30 bucks, so you know hopefully we can add this up. That's you know five, ten. This is uh Brett Michaels dog. Um <laughs> What do you call it? Dog vest, I guess? Motorcycle vest? I don't know. Uh, hopefully that's a buck or two. I didn't really check. This is uh, some basketball team. I don't even know who it is, but the cap looked really nice, so add that to it. I got the Simpson shirt, Christmas Simpson shirt. Trying to sell that for a few bucks. Uh, what else we got in here? We got the Suicide Squad shirt try to sell that for a buck or two got the just a Star Wars shirt you know Star Wars Star Wars is definitely gonna be kind of a theme today I got three more Star Wars things so anyways um, you know so hopefully that's at least you know 10 20 bucks worth of stuff right there we'll just say 10 for now we're moving on uh, got a mouse some stuff for a garage sale some fuses these remotes, a Philips Universal remote, will go for a couple bucks online. Um, probably get five, at least five bucks for that. <clears throat> These were interesting, just some Johnny Quest booster packs cards. They're on Amazon for about four bucks a piece, so there's 12 bucks right there. You know, so now what are we at? 20, 25 bucks, right? Got a old, or, I don't know, a digital can or a computer camera pack post-it still in the package got an xbox like connector thing for the roll xbox i saw the lady pick up all the controllers she just dismissed this little piece to it i don't know if that's worth a buck or two got a tarp got a knife sharpener got some um uh, what do you call this some puzzle mat i got that mainly for myself um got uh, a wireless Cisco wireless router. Um, hopefully that's worth a couple bucks. Uh, I saw a lady get like 20 games, so she lucked out, but I only got one of them. Xbox game, Namco 50th anniversary. 
So that's a cool find. The other one didn't have a game in it. It's just the case to it. Uh, I got a couple books. I don't think the books are going to go for much. I might make a two bucks off of each. So that's only going to be like six bucks. Now here is hopefully where I made my money back is this uh, Star Wars puzzle right here. It's not even open. Uh, 550 pieces. That thing's, you know, hopefully that's a $20 bill right there. That's pretty cool. I also got this bigger puzzle. Now this one is opened. Um, I just looked them up quick online. They start out at like $30. So hang on, let me open this quick. You know, it looked like it was all in there. Like it's just still in the bag. So now I'm going to try selling. I, you know, actually, you know, give me some advice, guys. Do I just sell this and act like I've counted all the pieces or... Do I sell it as an open box, you know, used at your own risk or something? I don't know. Let me know. I'm kind of torn on that. This was a Star Wars Monopoly game that somebody took the pieces out of the good, you know, metal metal ones like these things. But I pretty much got everything else to it, so I think that'll go for about 10 bucks online just for parts. Um, I also got a bag of phones. I've just heard from other scrappers that any kind of phone has gold in it, so those will go for some money. So I figured if I made my money back, then it, this would be like extra money, right? I also got these posters. They're like cycling posters. I got three of them. I'm going to try to maybe list those on eBay for a couple bucks, or maybe all as one, because they're all they all have like a cycling theme to it. So. Um, Oh, I also got a Super Mario bag. That's pretty cool. This is a little dollar bag or something, and an Angry Birds bag. I always get the coolest bags there. That's the other thing. I've been getting these cool, just you know, bags, reusable bags. That's the word I was looking for. Anyways, just want to share with you this uh, another experiment of mine. I'm trying to hopefully make a couple bucks and get a few thing, cool things on the side. I spent 31 bucks, you know, and. Hopefully I at least doubled my money. This kind of Star Wars theme. I just heard this Star Wars stuff sells. So, um, Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I'll try to keep you updated about how my selling's going. That's why I haven't been doing uploading so many videos lately. I've been trying to get my eBay store going and the Amazon store going. So it's been a lot of work. Um, I appreciate you guys liking, subscribing, and hopefully i can keep doing this and um show you how you can make some money on the side um anyways hope to, hope to see you later